the most important building block of the gymnast body is the joint preparation exercises. Many people don't know this and they make the mistake of focusing on the more advanced moves that should come way later in the training process. And these missing links result wrong implementations, hitting plateaus, lost motivation and in worst cases injuries. Even if you're a beginner or you have experience in training, this short overview will help you to understand the key of long-term process and you know what to do for it. As a beginner, you'll save many failures and if you have experience, you'll know how to press a reset, fill out the gaps and progress like you've never done before. Gymnasts build their insane performance, strength and physique on really wide and strong foundation with special preparation exercises. We usually call this process as joint preparation, but many love the term prehab since avoiding injuries is an important part of it. The goal of the joint preparation exercises is to prepare the body for the later exercises, increase the range of motion, so mobilize and strengthen, so stabilize the joints and avoiding injuries. Why is this important? Because your body is a complex structure made up of bones, muscles, tendons, joints, ligaments and connective tissues that are connected. The bodyweight exercises in most cases are compound exercises, which means that more joints are involved in the movements. All these joints should be prepared before you do those compound exercises. The areas involved in the compound exercises are the chains that are connected and need to be in harmony. Let's see in a few words what these mean in our context. The goal of the mobilization is to get the joints involved in an exercise to a level of range of motion that the exercise can be executed properly. This can be a simple dip, where if your shoulders are not mobile enough, you won't be able to do it in full range of motion, that will also affect your muscle up. But I could tell many examples, like the planche, where you need mobile wrists for the progressions, especially on the floor. And here comes the next point, mobile joints won't be enough if you don't have strength. To stick to the previous examples, you can have mobile shoulders if you can't push up yourself in the dip or muscle up, and you can have mobile wrists if you can't counter your body in the forward lean position. Not to mention that these exercises can be uncomfortable to execute in the beginning, especially without the joint preparation exercises, they can end with an injury. I could bring many other examples, but I hope you get the point now. So what's the solution? What should you do? You need to work on all joints that will be involved in any exercise later, do the mobilization and stabilization exercises, prepare your body for even the basics and the advanced moves. The recommended areas are the following hands and wrists, elbows, scapulas, shoulders, core, hips, knees, and ankles. In terms of any upper body exercise, the scapula area and core are particularly important. I'll talk more about this later. This complex process as a beginner or for someone who've never done these exercises before makes up a whole training session. Don't be mistaken by these low intensity, isolated movements. They are actually pretty hard to do right and you will feel your body afterwards. Those who do it for the first time usually say that they feel muscles that they have never felt before. But they say that it feels good to do the exercises, they move more freely, feel stronger and more stable. This is the point of the whole joint preparation process and this is the secret of the gymnast body and strength, the most important building block. If you build on this foundation, you will feel much stronger, not only in the basics, but in the more advanced moves once you get there. Your form will be better and you'll be able to do more reps thanks to the stability. In the following videos, I show you how gymnasts prepare some of these areas and how they build up their physique from scratch. I've already talked about the warm-up, which is essential before doing any preparation exercise, and now it's time to move on. But if you want to save time and start the complete process I've mentioned from beginning till the end, download the Gymnastics Method app in the App Store or Google Play Store and get started with the plans that have been done by thousands of people worldwide and covers 15 years of training experience. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. If you haven't watched my earlier videos about joint preparation, check them out on the screen now.